today we're going to be on uh, a fellow. I don't know if he wants his name out here, but basically uh, he lent me his account to do a little showcase on Arrow. This is not going to be a full champion guide. I mean, I'll go over his kit because I don't know his real um, you know, kit too in-depth because I don't have this champion. But I have seen him in Arena and I've gone up against him and he has hit the shit out of me before. So um, I, I do want to play with him a little bit just to kind of get a good feel for him. And maybe if there's other Arrow lovers, uh, Arrow lovers out there, you guys can give me some sauce, a little bit insight. I'm assuming he's well-rated now, specifically an Arena Champion. Of course, he's going to help you out in Faction Wars. I don't see too much work for him in, in the dungeons. But yeah, his A1, extra 30% chance of inflicting a crit hit. A2 is going to be AoE, two-hitter, with a 30% chance of uh, inflicting crits. And then a 15% chance of ignoring the defense. I'm, I'm thinking this move right here is the move that completely smashes an Arena. His A3, Negation, attacks one enemy, removing all debuffs from this champion and steals all the buffs from the target before attacking with a 30% chance of inflicting a crit hit and then grants an extra turn if the target is killed. Here is Masteries. As always, do not blindly copy Masteries, but go ahead and blindly copy these master uh, Masteries. We're taking Helm Smasher to get that extra chance to ignore even more defense. This is how he has him built right here. Now, personally, I would not use this kind of build. I would go out of my way to make sure that he was in Savage or Lethal. Uh, but I can also understand why he's not quite there yet. What about Cruel? I'd probably consider Cruel. And Merciless would, or Merciless and Slayer. I'd probably put on one of these sets. Lethal? I don't see any Lethal. But yeah, that's, that's what I would go for. You, you want ignored defense gear sets. And that's what I would go for. But these are the pieces of gear that he has for Errol. I'm pretty sure we're focusing on high crit damage. Making sure we're crit capped. And an attack percent on the boots is nice. With the attack percent on the Ascension. That's pretty nice. Probably probably rework this. This, uh, you know, I guess... Like, what level is that? He's at 81. I'd focus a little bit on trying to farm... The Fire Knight. Of course, we're getting crit damage on crit damage, but the direction is correct. The direction is nice. I can see this being useful. I was thinking maybe, uh, you know, you want to go for an attack banner. That's probably what I would go for, but I also understand why. Like, you get the attack percentage, you got the max out here. We have uh, a decent amount of HP. It's a lot more HP than I was expecting to be put on a nuker, but we have 7,000. A little over 7,000 attack, and that's pretty nice. 179 speed, that's okay. Uh, you know, most of my nukers, I try to get around 220. Now, the crit rate is at 70%, but I just remembered that he has a 30% chance on his skills to hit hard, or to, to crit hit, basically. So I can see you getting away with only 70%. Over 300 crit damage, these are solid stats. Let's go ahead and try him out in live arena to begin with. We'll see. Uh, we'll see what we do. Arrow really only needs seventy percent. Oh, okay. Then yeah, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Thank you for pointing that out. Yeah, Arrow only needs seventy percent. One of the best nukers now. One of your favorite nukers. Okay. I don't know if or how any of these guys are built, but let's go ahead and just start out with Sun Wukong. We don't talk about money. We don't talk about money, guys. Wait, how did he choose Sun Wukong? Wait. Oh, this is not gold. Never mind. What am I saying? We don't talk about nukers. Or oh, we don't talk about the money. A1. Let's see. Uh, let's bring in UDK. I don't know how any of these guys are built, so we'll, we'll see. Hey, Tiger, what's up? Thanks for coming in, bro. Mithrala. I should probably... Where's Tormund at? Oh, there's no Tormund here. Oh, okay. Uh, hmm. I'm assuming this is a uh, damage build. Arbiter's at 318 speed. Very nice. Very nice. I'm thinking about banning his Lady Kimmy. That might be where we're going to have to go. But then Mithrala could be very annoying as well. We'll see. 
Your mithral is at 270 speed. Ooh, who do I ban? I kind of feel like banning Lady Kimmy. But then his only damage dealer would probably be Sun Wukong, I think. I don't know who this is. This is Shogger. Does Shogger do damage? Let's just ban Sun Wukong. That makes sense. All right, we'll we'll we'll, we'll try we'll try this out. We'll see what's going to happen. Maybe we're going to win this one. Kind of depends. We're definitely going to be going slower. But yeah, I don't I don't know if he's got any damage on him. I haven't done live arena in like two months. Chogger does do damage. Oh boy. Oh my god. He can hit? Apparently so. Let's do this. Yo, why are you hitting me? It's not your turn right now, man. UDK, put it in. Oh, nice. So he does... Your, your UDK is putting in some damage. That's cool. Boom. Get a little sheep on that ass. Ares, what's up, bro? Thanks for stopping in. I'm just doing an account... I'm doing a... a for a video, I'm doing an a, account showcase... Jaroslaw let me on his account, and I'm, uh... I'm testing out Errol, but Errol's dead. So I probably should have uh, picked out a better team. But hopefully, you're doing well. Hopefully, everybody's doing well. I didn't know that Shogger could put in work. My bad. But then I had to choose between either him or, um... Or Sun Wukong, and I felt like Sun Wukong would have been... Uh, more of a hassle to deal with. Your, your Sun Wukong is in a hybrid build? I gotcha. I gotta get rid of Shogger. He's like the main threat here. The showcase of Errol is him taking a nap. Hey, we'll get him on the next try. We'll get him on the next try. I'm testing Errol, but he's dead right now. He's sleeping. He's taking a nice little nap. Let's do this. Maybe I should have started with... Uh... Oh my god, she got petrified. Maybe I should have started with her using her counterattack. There we go. There we go. As long as Mithrala doesn't cleanse, but I don't think so. Didn't she just cleanse? Yeah, we're good. Oh, we're Gucci. There you go. Auto. You got Marius and Ramantu two days ago, literally on the same day. Dude, that's awesome. I think, yeah, right about now is when everybody's getting Marius. Let me know how uh, Marius is, because uh, he looks like a fun champion, but I'm, I'm ways away from, from getting Mar Marius. But congratulations, that's that's huge. I don't know why I had assumed you, you had um, all the champions already. Who do we focus down on? I think we should focus down on Mithrala. Because now this is just a, a battle of... Uh, Taking them down one by one, slowly. And I think the biggest issue here is that Mithrala is petrifying everybody. And that's an issue. Yeah, I'll take a look at your champions real quick. 15 months to get Ramatsu, only 3 months to get Marius. Crazy how easy they made it to get him. Yeah, it's, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy how... How the difference is. Because, like, I remember it took me a long time to get Ramatsu. And I'm seeing everybody... Um, what do you call, I'm seeing everybody getting uh, Marius already or like people in my, my discord are almost there so it's crazy yeah. didn't wait till personal CVC I don't I don't think you have to wait till personal CVC if you're Aries cause uh, my dude's putting up a lot of CVC points been only playing for over a year. Yeah, I believe. Scratch's uh, showcase of Marius did 40% more DPS than Acrisia? 40% more DPS than Acrisia in Hydra is insane. Oh, wait. I was going to look at your characters real quick. Okay, I guess we're not. Pratuk? All right. Let's see here. Marius is easy if you have the energy. 
I think the biggest thing for me doing Marius, and by the way, Tin Hong, uh, thanks for stopping in, bro. Or Kraven. Oh, you changed your name. I, um, what do you call it? I think the biggest thing for me is is the time gate missions. The time gated missions are like the, the, the biggest thing for me. The most annoying thing, really. Eryx is hitting. Yeah, Eryx is hitting. Because, like, having to get the mortal soul coins from Iron Twins is a time-gated thing. Right? And then, uh, oh, I almost didn't pick Errol. Where's Errol at? Guys, who are we banning? Who are we banning? You got Ninja. I think we're going we're gonna to have to get rid of Knight. I mean, not Nut. Oh my god. Uh, Nishak. I think that's the best option here. I don't want to get bombed to hell here. I'm not going to outspeed him. Now, Sun Wukong is going to be an issue, I think. And guys, remember, I was never a great PvP person to begin with. And I haven't done Live Arena in, like, the longest time. Oh my god, Errol, stop dying. I, I want one win with Errol. You know what? We're just going to go to Classic Arena. Let's see. Let's see this. Let's check out this preset team already. Getting five mythical chests took for... Yeah, that, that also uh, is an issue. Having to... Because that took me a while also. Oh my god, this is not a, the best uh, showcase I've done. This is... Yeah. Crit damage guy. Yeah, the Super Kraken account he showed marius on was with a Marius with no blessing against the Krizia and Grazer. Both six-star blessing, crushing Ren, and Marius did what a Krizia and Grazer did combined. Check out his characters. I'll look at his characters. Errol needs one round of stone skin. Probably. Here's the thing, though. If, if I even check his characters, I don't know if that would make a difference. Let's try again. Okay, we have the attack up. We're going to speed ourselves up. Put that down. And then let's see what his AoE does. Boom. I oh, That was too fast for me. I didn't see what happened. Let's try again. And we get outsped and clapped. Let me see what he does here. All right, let's try this negation ability. See how hard it hits. 242 is what I saw. You farm level 7 spider with Eric's 7-piece slayer, sl uh, slayer set. Murders the spider fast. Nice. Outsped again. It's crazy, because this ultimately just turns into a speed battle. Right? Alright, I'm going to slow this down. I want to see, see everything. Alright, 5, I didn't see. Did anybody catch that? I think 58. I saw 58 on UDK. 58k. Hey, everybody. Do a video possibly if you wanted uh, him to hop on. Hop on? Yeah, for sure. I actually have to probably get a thumbnail for Marius. But yeah, I'd be down. Thank you. That'd be fun to check out. Six piece Eric's Eric's in stone skin. Yeah. Dude, I hate this guy. Sigfriend. Uh okay, let's do this first. Of course. And there's dead. He's dead. No. Nope. I'm gonna let it go. I'm gonna let it go. Alright, Taurus. Let's see how, how hard he hits against Taurus. All right, we're going to try the negation ability on him. And we'll try that. We'll see how much it does. Let's slow it down here. Against Taurus, you're looking at 13k. Okay. Oof. Taurus, don't do it. Don't, Taurus. Don't you do it. Don't you hit me. God damn it, Taurus. All right, well, 
how to enter the giveaway. The giveaway is uh, finished already. It was uh, on a video that I that I did, and I um, released it like four or five days ago. You had to leave a joke on the on the video, and I just did the random comment picker. And yeah, the the account's been uh, hasn't been given away yet. If you want, you can. Because if he doesn't respond to me in 24 hours, I'm going to redraw the winner. 93. Very nice. Yeah, the team got wicked. Let's try this one here. Giveaway is over already. Yeah, that was the first thing I knocked out of the park. Boom! 77 on Pytheon. That was pretty nice. Yeah, so this is, pr uh, this is a pretty nice team. I think it's just a matter of getting Arbiter faster, but y you already know how that works. Trying to win a speed battle. Use gems. The team isn't speed tune. I thought it was. Arbiter, right? Arbiter, then Lady Kimmy. Let me, let's use that team. It was it was Arbiter, Lady, Lady Kimmy. Then uh, Madam Sari went. And then Errol smashed. Tyler, let's hear the joke. Tyler, you didn't you didn't drop your a link to your uh, YouTube account, bro. I'm trying to I'm trying to give some support. I'm trying to see. Your content, bro. I'm trying to see it, bro. I'm trying to get it in. No ditty, though. Where's, uh... Where's Madam Sarah? Hold on. Madam Sarah's. Errol is getting cut in. Probably make Errol faster. Yeah, I feel that. Yumiko. Oh, hell no. Nah. Probably SWK. Oh, we're getting swiped, though. I mean, look at this. He's got Hefrak plus one. Yumiko, I think. Let's hear the joke. How much did the pirate pay for his earrings? I don't know. How much? Come on, Kezaragon. Don't make me wait. I don't want to wait. Let's get rid of his... Let's try to outspeed him. There we go. Oh, yeah. And for the person that asked me about waiting until CVC, Burrito's right. I dropped 400 points just in Spider-10. Normally do five to 800 CVC, but only pulled Marius. A Buccaneer? Yeah, I don't think um, Ares is worried about an extra 30k or, or whatever. I think he's. I think he's solid. Oh, come on. Twice? Twice it didn't get removed. Smash. Oh, that was a mistake. That was a mistake on my... I shouldn't have done that. I forgot Hefrak. I'm surprised this Hefrak didn't kill, though. A buck and ear. Oh, a buck and ear. I got you. I got the joke. I got the joke. Waiting to pull Romansu during CVC. Hey, AG White, man. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate you. Thanks for showing love. Th thanks for um, hanging out. Oh, no, you're good, Isaac. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. But yeah, the video was uh, posted four days ago, and that's where it is. But but that's that's usually how it how it works. I, uh, if I have an account to give away or if I have a giveaway video, um, it'll be posted, and then I usually tell you tell people something. And just to make sure that people don't just come in and, and cheese the video, I uh, I make somebody I make you guys do something else than just putting a specific word. Because what a lot of people do is they they come to they go to videos. People will actually go to YouTube videos and they'll just type in free giveaway videos. And I understand why because people can make money off of it if they just cop a lot of uh, free giveaway videos. Then they could just turn around and sell it. You know, it's whatever. But I don't want that happening with me. So a lot of people will just go to the comment section and they'll just look for a keyword, but I don't do keywords, uh, at least anymore. So I'll have you do something like, oh, um, uh, tell me a joke or, or something like that. But yeah, that's usually how it is. I put put out the giveaway video and then I do a stream after. Yeah, no worries though. Staltus is back, exactly. And he's got shoes in. Bro! How is anybody supposed to compete nowadays? There's no competing. How 
How? How are we going to do this? Moshalid's going to kill the crap out of me, and if he doesn't, he will. Even if I ban Arbiter, Shu Zen's going to outspeed me. And Molly Tankard is going to... Oh, boy. All right, let's just get rid of Arby. Let it happen. Yep, that's of, of course the case here. I want to ban everybody here. This is why I haven't done Live Arena. I don't do Live Arena anymore. Now, some of you guys might just say, get good. And to that I say, eh. No, it's all fun. It's all fun. I'm having fun. All right, we can try... Let's do this. At least get the chance to petrify. At least try and petrify. Come on now. Do your move. Come on. There's only one thing you're going to do. Oh, I guess there was two things you were going to do. I would have done the A1. Oh, okay, that's why. He's so big-brained. He's ahead of me. He's thinking way ahead of me. I don't play Live Arena anymore. Okay, good. Wrong game. Elden Ring DLC comes out next month. A bit early. Bro, I'm so excited for it. Uh, if you guys don't know, I have another channel where I play... Uh, I've got two other channels. But I do uh, other games there, and I'm definitely going to be playing uh, the new Elden Ring DLC. Yeah, I'm so hyped, bro. It is super hard, Mike. You're totally right. It's hard It's hard to compete when you're free to play. I, I feel for you guys. He's got shoes in. And I actually really love Martial Ed. He's still an awesome champion. Hey, but Sun Wukong puts in work. He does. Hey, uh, OG, if you want to send me your details. Oh, you already got it. Collector's Edition is coming soon? Yeah, bro. I'm hyped. Errol's dead. Errol's dead. Yeah. Look at this person taking their time to make decisions. Come on. Let's move. Sun Wukong with all of these buffs. But he's got fear on him. Name of the video will be trying, trying to showcase Errol. There it is, the fear. Come on. Yes, he petrified. Oh, UDK's dead. UDK's dead. Wukong smacked the crap out of Molly, put her in the dirt. Oh, this is so painful to watch. Masha Led, where is he good for the end of early game? Masha Led's pretty much good anywhere. I'd say uh, Arena and Hydra. You could also use him in Clan Boss, in the Demon Lord Clan Boss. But uh, he he did some he did some uh, work for me in in Hydra early on. He just hits so hard the leech, and the AOE when you get the 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 leech on. So yeah. Masha Led is so fucking ass, bro.